So as I said, I've tried to keep some of the V9 styling cues. Make it, you know, just keep the theme. Some of the lines here, that sort of stuff. These are the original side covers. Of course, we've got a turbo in there. I like the holes. I like the lightning holes here. You know the cool thing about these bikes? Everything's made out of metal. It's got, like, fuck all plastic on it. It's, uh, anyway, I like them. So I detabbed it already, and I'm going to make up some little bit different side covers. So, I got this one, just sanded a little bit. I'm gonna, you know what color these are gonna be? They're gonna be polished aluminum color. I think polished aluminum is now a color. And if it's not, fuck it, it is. I said it is. So what I did, I just welded this on the front, give it a nice little reveal. There's a reason I did that. So I didn't just want them flat in the, the Zeus. Also, I'm going to cut this around the turbo outlet here. Be nice. I said this would be polished, kept the holes. But see, I've got this line following the tank line. And then this follows the frame down nice. And also, when you look from the top, from the top it follows the tank line. So it doesn't look like some flat piece of metal some Australian threw together and just put on there. Even though that's what it is. But it's not a flat piece of metal now. Good friend of mine, hopefully he's going to make some badges. So we're going to put similar badges on there. We're going to change the Roma part. Of course, we'll keep the motor guzzy, but the V9, put the badges in there. So we keep a lot of the design of the original V9, but it's exactly the same but different. You know what? We, we don't need badges. I can take care of this. It's done. Of course, I was almost ready to take the whole thing apart because I strip, I've already stripped the lower frame legs and some other bits and pieces because I'm stripping this powder coat off and I'm going to get a different color on the frame, which I'm not going to say at the moment, but you've probably got a good idea. Um, but I was almost ready because I got most of the metalwork roughed out so I can take it apart, but it's like, oh, I'll make these. And it's like, I need to stop and just get it stripped because we're supposed to have these bikes at the barber thing in October, early October, so I better get a wriggle on and get this shit finished. <laughs>